people who are looking at tiny houses, um, their interest is driven by different reasons. I lived in a tiny house, 13.6 square meters, uh, which is 140 square feet for two and a half years together with my son, just me and him. Then I built an A-frame next to the tiny house. A-frame is bigger. It's like uh, about 100 square meters or 1000 square feet. It was uh, interesting and very necessary experience. Uh, why I did this move, this big life change was like many of us, my life got too complicated. I had two jobs. I had a huge mortgage payment, uh, demanding wife and uh, well, I just felt that I can't do it anymore. And then when I had a divorce, I sold everything, bought a piece of forest and built a tiny house. And um, the main reason uh, why tiny house was, uh, well, I was left with some money and I decided that I won't take any loans or credits on me. What I have, this I will use to build my new home that wasn't really much and I built this tiny cabin I had to or sell or give away most of my belongings I couldn't even afford the vacuum cleaner in the tiny house well not financially but there was literally no space for a vacuum cleaner so uh, and uh, learning to live with a bare minimum that was that was very good, uh, good experience. And when I moved to this bigger A-frame, I was very conscious about buying new things. I only bought uh, something when I really actually needed it. And I still do, well, except the knives, of course. <laughs> you can cut it out. <laughs> also, one really interesting experience I had uh, while living in my own tiny house was uh, since well you can fit the bare minimum inside the tiny house so you can you can lay down you can eat you can sleep maybe watch TV but there's not much to do in that house so my social life really improved because I went to my tiny house just to just to sleep so yeah after work, I visit friends, went to cinema, or did what I like to do because, well, it was boring at home. <laughs> and boring can be a good thing. If you really need to do a big change in your life, uh, this tiny house may be a really good way to do a fresh start. Uh, you will probably not live there until end of your life but um, but for a for some time it's really a good option to rethink your life and restart your life uh, it did provide me a really fresh start I could live my uh, leave my old life behind me and well it may it may do the same for you if you really need it and uh, when I was done with my tiny house my, and I moved into the A-frame next to it, well, I still use it because my mother lives there. So uh, you can sell it or use it as a guest house. Or, so even if it's temporary but, uh, for your life, you can still use it as a hobby room, home office, guest house, renting it out. Or like I did, uh, gave it to my mother. I have to take care of her, so it's very convenient to have her close. Well, actually this tiny house gave me the opportunity to change my life into the di direction I needed to do it. And that's why we created this new product family, Solo Plus. You can see it at tinyhouse.abrahim.com. So you can have the same opportunity.